not far away. I went to visit for a day. Got covered with some gooey ooze that changed my DNA. Now I try to act normal, keep my cool. My other kids play after school. I turn into a prehistoric hero. I'm in. Today on Dino Squad, an internet game takes a dangerous turn when Buzz accidentally reveals personal information about himself to a new online friend who is actually Victor Pelosi. <laughs> Kudos, Geekasaur. That's one dark and delicious online game you built. It's not just a game, Buzz. It's also got dinosaur research links, email, individual blog pages, and plays your favorite tunes. But does it link to online shopping sites? I need a new comb. I want to put your pick on my blog, dude. Right next to my pet tarantula. Sorry, Buzz, but no pictures of us on the web or any other personal information. Roger's right. We've got to protect our dino identities. It's not just your secret identities, Max. Revealing your actual identities to strangers is just as dangerous. There are predators out there, don't you know? Yeah, velociraptors. I'm not talking about dinosaurs, Buzz. I'm talking about people who use the internet to lure kids, and sometimes even adults, into dangerous situations. But enough serious stuff, huh? You kids have been working hard lately, in school and as a mutant hunting team. So, instead of the usual training, we're going to York Pond for a little sport. A mutant stink bugosaurus? How cool is that? Come on, Buzz. I'm almost through this level. You guys go on, I'll catch up with you in a few minutes. You can play when you get home. We've got to rock. That's okay, Max. Tonight's activity is meant as a reward. If Buzz wants to stay here and play on the computer, he's welcome. Okay. But don't forget the web rules, Buzz. Yeah, yeah. I'm almost 18. It's not like I need an electronic babysitter. You can run, but you can't hide from the buzzinator. This game rocks. And I bet it's even rockier with an online opponent. Yo, Triceratops dude. Wanna go dino a dino? Come and get me, Pteranodon! All right! You're going extinct. Uh, you ready to tell us what we're doing here? Not quite so tight there, Max. You betcha. We're going to play hockey. Dinosaur hockey. Gotcha. You're fossil food, dude. See you in that Jurassic parking lot in the sky. Ooh, sticky! A widow raptor? Wicked move! I've got wickeder, Pteranodon! Whoa! I'm being trounced by a girl raptor? But not for long. How old are you? 
17. You? Same. What else do you like besides online gaming? Uh, the usual. Piercings, snakes, punk stuff. I'm into piercing snakes and punk. Get out. What are the odds of two snaky pierced punkers meeting in Dino Cyberspace? What do your friends call you? Buzz. Uh, that's just, uh, my nickname. Well, Buzz, your nickname's gonna be loser when I'm through with you. In your nightmares, raptor girl. You sure this ice is thick enough to support us in dino mode? Oh yeah, I checked it out yesterday. Now remember what I told you, it's all about mass and momentum. <laughs> Maybe for you, for me it's all about n numb nose and f frozen toes. Fiona's got a point. We're just big cold-blooded lizards in dino mode. If our body temps drop too low, we'll fall asleep and go dormant. Not if you keep moving. It'll be good training should you ever have to go dino in cold weather. Don't we get to wear pretty ice skates? Trust me, you'll have enough difficulty without them. Max, you go first. No sweat. I've been playing hockey since I was in preschool. Anticipate your movement. Whoa! And while you're at it, anticipate a very cold backside. You want to see a true artist on ice? Then you want to see El Caruso! Just keep at it. The repetition of movement will induce a physiological change, build up muscle memory. You've got to crawl before you can walk. May I have this crawl? Love to. dinosaurs roaming the earth. Me too. In fact, I've seen one. When I was auditioning for the You Famous reality show, it was a big cockroach-like mutant. Get out of here. I saw the same one. Now you're just teasing me. I even saw this shark mutate into a megalodon after it was contaminated with this gross primordial ooze. Primordial ooze. So, you know that primordial ooze mutates animals, do you? Very well. Let's take this game to the next level and find out what else you know. Switching to motion capture. B Man, 17, Pumpkin. Perfect. Hey, Buzz. Avatars are for kids. This is what I really look like. Whoa, you don't look like a nasty raptor at all. How about showing me what you look like? Uh. I thought you'd be better looking. Sorry, I'm not allowed to show my real face. That's cool. I'm not supposed to show mine either, but I cheat sometimes because it's more fun if you can see the real person behind the avatar. So, is your room wickedly punked out too? Nah, my room's just messy. But I'm not in my room. I'm in a light, er, like, just a place I hang out. What do you call a velociraptor who plays video games online? I don't know, what? An internet predator. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, that's nothing to joke about. Internet predators are even nastier than raptors. Yeah, but not as nasty as this big bad raptor. <laughs> 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 
All eyes are riveted on El Caruso as he glides down the ice, skillfully sets the puck, and... Blows it like a royal klutzosaurus. Take a lesson from a real hockey jockey. After you take a lesson from a rocket jockey. Caruso, heads up! Hey, this is hockey, not an ice ballet. If you don't slow down, it's gonna be a poor dino pileup! There's a lesson to be learned here, you know. We should have gone bowling? Yeah, there's that. And there's keep focused on the task at hand, and knock off the hot dogging. Roger, keep moving or your temperature will drop. Roger? He's gone dormant. Roger. Get up. Or change back to normal. But do something. How do we wake him, Ms. M? We've got to warm him up. Too bad I left my hair dryer back at home. We don't need your hair dryer, Caruso. We've got your mouth. Right. Hot air. Let's do it. I'm poisoned! Gross! Your breath isn't exactly minty fresh either. A Dimetrodon! Duck! Whoa! That was perfectly prehistoric, wasn't it? Say, Bob, speaking of perfect, have you ever seen a perfect dinosaur? You kidding? I can see one from where I'm sitting. No way! That's like totally hideous. Where do you live? Sorry, no can say. Nickname, video rank, and high school only. Yeah, well, you've got to at least tell me what state you live in, so I can be sure never to go near there. I suppose that couldn't hurt. I'm a Maine dude. Awesome! I'm in Maine too! Prepare the truck. We're going to Maine. Well, Buzz, my 17-year-old punk friend from Maine, just keep giving me those little pieces and soon I'll have the entire puzzle. Hey, Buzz. What school do you go to? Look, Big Bag Raptor, I'm sure you're a nice girl and all, so it's nothing personal, but I promise to follow internet safety rules. That's okay. I've got rules to follow, too. And in this case, the rule is, if at first you don't deceive, get more deceitful. Raptor girl. I win! I think there's something outside my bedroom window. Ah! Everything okay? There's a mutant raptor out there! What happened? Can you hear me? It's trying to get in. I can help you. What's your address? 51 Turn Circle, at the end of Spruce Point. The Buzzinator can handle a mutant raptor. <laughs> If he won't lead me to him, I'll lead him to me. Hey, Buzz, you missed one outrageous hockey game. Buzz? Buzz! Maybe he got tired of playing and went home. We would have passed him on the road. Wherever he went, he must have been in a hurry. He forgot to take his communicator. It's Buzz. He's in dino mode. And he just flew out of range of the lighthouse's protective beam, which means Veloci can see him too. Come on, guys. Let's roll. Hope I'm not too late. Hello? Raptor girl? This is not good. Oh my! 
This is Mother Saurus. Have you heard from Buzz? No, but I know where he's headed. Where? Straight into a trap. <laughs> Dude, you're like so lame. You've just been hoaxed by an online hoaxster. Unless it was... What do you call a Velociraptor who plays video games online? Victor Velocity. Send up the cop. I saw, but I can't track it in stealth mode. Man, if Buzz had followed the rules, he wouldn't be in this mess. Right you are, Roger. And if Velocity thinks those rules apply only to kids, we may just be able to catch him in his own trap. As soon as I get you back to my lab, we'll see just what makes your dinosaur gene so perfect. Mr. Velocity, this is Raptor Dime Security. We've spotted more dinosaurs in your area. You'll need another truck. What's your location? I'm on Highway 9, heading south past Porter Road. Gotcha. them off the road. Time to see how much we learn from Ms. Moynihan's lesson. Is that the hockey lesson or the bad breath lesson? Don't strain your pretty brain, Caruso. Just push. Okay, Roger. Take that can opener of yours and do your stuff. Sorry, Ms. M. I guess maybe I needed that electronic babysitter after all. No, Buzz. You just need to remember that internet predators can be very clever. That's why we've got to stick to the rules, especially when we're tempted to break them. They're not just for children, don't you know? Even a predator like Velocity can be fooled. What was that? We've got mail. Dear lucky winner, you have just won $50 million in our global email sweepstakes. To receive your prize, just email your name, address, mother's maiden name, social security, and checking account numbers to the address below. Hooey, man! Did you hear that? 50 million buckaroos! 
We're rich! We're super rich! No, we're more than super rich. We're dinosaurian rich. Got my parents' bank account numbers, my social security card, mother's maiden name. What? Caruso, haven't you learned anything? Huh? Oh, right. They'll want my father's maiden name, too. Caruso! Okay, okay. I got the message. It's only 50 million. I can live without it. I'm in, I'm in, in the Dino Squad. You don't have to be a Dino Squad hero to help save the Earth. Be cool. Reduce, reuse, recycle. Now I try to act normal, keep my cool. Other kids play after school, I turn into a prehistoric hero. I'm in!